Busy, thank you. After months of staying at home and maybe binge watching, you have the option of going to the movies again, supporting an industry that has lost hundreds of millions of dollars just this year. It has been hit hard. We've been talking about theaters reopening gradually. Each one took the first step towards normalcy. Today, another big day. We have live team coverage this morning. AMC reopening five locations. We're taking a look in our area. We're taking a look at the safety protocols across the industry now and the efforts to save them from going dark. As of earlier this month, 43 states are permitting indoor cinemas to operate. Here's the map. The states in red, including California and New York, show theaters are closed. Kansas and Missouri are both allowing movie theaters to open with certain practices in place, including social distancing. AMC, of course, locally based, one of those companies practicing social distancing. Today, their safety procedures will be put to the test for the first time. So this morning, we're showing you what you can expect if you do go back to a theater. 41 Action News anchor Bryant Madrick is live to share the details about this. Bryant? Hey, good morning, Taylor and Lindsay. Yes, today is the day that the theaters for AMC reopen, including this one here in the Northland. Now, we reached out to a spokesperson for AMC to see if someone could actually talk to us on camera about what the procedures look like in keeping you and your family safe. Unfortunately, they couldn't get anyone available for us, but they did give us a statement and also provided some promotional video that shows what that process looks like. Company has a sanitation program. They call it AMC Safe and Clean. Now, they say it includes a limited number of available tickets for each show along with seat blocking for proper social distancing. There's also enhanced cleaning with electrostatic sprayers, HEPA vacuums and upgraded air filtration. Customers will also notice mask mandates, hand sanitizer stations and disinfectant wipes. One potential movie goer said she might consider going to the theater. I think as long as you know you're masked up and you're maintaining social distance and there's probably going to be space between chairs and stuff, I think I would. All right. So one possible movie goer, this theater here in the Northland or right off of Barry Road, just one of 100 theaters across the country that will reopen today. Taylor Lindsay, back to you.